chapter number one is Mr. Ng with uh, John Colley, chapter five, number six. Uh, this problem has a bunch of goofy little conversions that you have to deal with. So let's get through this problem. Uh, what is the magnitude of acceleration of a speck of clay on the edge of a potter's wheel turning at 45, um, degree, uh, 45 ro revolutions per minute and the wheel's diameter is 32 centimeters? So here um, we know that the period is related to 45 revolutions per minute, right? So let's write that out, 45 revs over minutes. And then we could just convert out of minutes. So we know that one minute, notice that I put minute on top so that the units cancel, is equal to 60 seconds. So that becomes um, 0.75 revs per second. But wait, is this a period or is this a frequency? Revs per second, that's a frequency, right? This is RF. And we know that a period is equal to 1 over the frequency, so that's going to be 1 over 0.75, so that becomes 1.33 seconds. That's our actual period. On top of that, it also gives us uh, 32 centimeters as a diameter. So if 32 centimeters is a diameter, then that means um, the radius is half of that. So that's going to be 16 centimeters. Um, we know that this needs to be in meters, so it's going to be 0.16 meters. So uh, we have all the things that we need. We have an R, we have a period. Let's just plug it into our um, acceleration equation. So by now, many of you should be used to this equation, where acceleration is equal to 4 pi squared r over period squared. So just plug in the digits that we have here, r being 16 or 0.16 meters, 4 pi squared times 0.16 divided by the period squared, which is 1.33 squared. So if you punch that all in correctly, you should get... 3.57 meters per second squared. Good. So again, the trick with this problem is, number one, you should know that um, revolutions per minute is not a period. It's a frequency. And all you got to do is uh, do the inverse of that and convert it into seconds. And then know that a diameter is not r. r is half of that. And make sure that the unit is in meters. Thank you very much for watching.